let's take his eye. Um, yeah, here's looking at you, kid. Uh, let's take that. Well, hello, Shirley Rocks here. Welcome back to Breath Edge. So, I've been doing a little bit of uh, collecting since the last video, so as you can see. I've got lots of the oxygen candles. We found quite a few of those in the bit by the uh, broken oxygen reclaiming unit thing. Uh, we found quite about th three or four units of thicker electrical tape. And that means I have now managed to make two of these. And we also found a couple of light bulbs in there. That's the wrong button. That was so the wrong button. Um, so I think I'm about ready to go and do a little bit of exploring. So I'm just going to make a little bit more food. Now where did that light bulb go? There you go. Let's put that back in there. So it's right, no, left click to transfer. Right, let's go and make a little bit more water. And a little bit more food. I don't know how long I'm going to be. So we're going to go and explore the um, the sensor reading that's on the left in this episode. So we're going to eat that, drink that, and now we should be good to go. So I have got my handy scrapper there. I've got 11 slots left in that one, and I've got another full one there. I've got my grabber. I've got me drill. Now, I feel like I'm missing something. The only thing I've not got is a cutter. Yeah, I think I'm going to make one of those. Now, how do I make one? Oh, is it scissors? Back scratcher? Uh, tape and rubber, maybe? I literally can't remember the recipe. It's the scissory thing we need. Oh, we need three lots of metal. Luckily, I have all of the metals. Okay, we're just, we're just going to make one of one of these. I don't know if we need to make any rubber while we're out and about, so... We might as well uh, make one. Nice. Okay, right, so that's going to be in slot two. Let's get this open again. Now, we don't need that back scratcher. We don't need to be carrying loose materials. Okay. That will do. Uh, I might take a couple of oxygen candles in case I get in trouble. And let's have nothing equipped there. And off we go into space. Right, so we're going to go over here. So, now is it worthwhile me going down there and then going that way? There's a midpoint over there, you see. Uh, yeah, let's go down here. Uh, get our oxygen back, and then we're gonna go and, uh, try and get to this other bit. Okay, so... Let's get filled up. Oh, the one time I didn't want that bug to happen. Let's see if we can trigger it so we're not cheating. There we go. Woo! Right, so now we're coming back over here. Ooh, where's it gone? I've literally, I'm going to have to go back in again. I've literally lost my bearings. Right, so it's, there's no north, south, east and west, right. So, if we take a left, it's, it's, it's basically directly behind us. Right, let's go back in again. Okay, full oxygen. No. There we go, right. Okay, we're just going to burn towards this as fast as we can. To whatever this structure is here. And then, I'll be able to show you the, um... Tool that I've got. Well, I say tool, it's a, um... Oxygen station. So what is this? Is it another ship? Is that blood everywhere? What is it? The shuttle was flooded with paint during the crash. Ooh. Even the service center wouldn't be able to clean it from the inside. It's impossible okay. to repair it. The paint itself also has no value after freezing. And we're looking for paint, aren't we? Ooh. I can see various bits. Nothing that exciting, though. Lots of metal around, though. Hang on, there's something down here. Uh, Right, oxygen should be okay for now. Ooh, scissors. 
Um, it's probably the owner of the shuttle with paint. He was engaged in illegal pumping. Okay. Crash, judging by the we need to. Uh, and a huge hose stuck to his face. We need to get this equipped. Right. So this is going to give us our oxygen back. So if we deploy this. Skills will be reconsidered. I recommend that you investigate the immediate. And then you fill oxygen. There we go. For flying to the evacuation zone. So as you can see, this has got 500 oxygen in it. And that will, it's just basically a massive balloon full of air. Right, so let's have a little look at this. So what's this? So there's a guy here. Examine his eye. Electricity. We can use, should we use it? Okay. We're using the chicken to disrupt the electricity. Okay. That is quite, uh, yeah, that's quite graphic. Let's take his eye. Um, yeah, here's looking at you, kid. Uh, let's take that. Smuggler's eyes can open any lock with a retina scanner. Okay, so if we find the retina scanner, we might be able to open it. What's this? Metal. I'm not going to turn down a bit of free metal. Uh, and we wanted lead paint, didn't we? Now, this is all paint. <laughs> what a way to go. I don't know. These developers have a <laughs> funny sense of humor. I'm pretty sure. Wait a minute. Is my oxygen going down quicker? Right, let's fill it up again. That seems to go down really quick then. Right, we're on full again. Okay. So we're just going to collect all of the metals in this area. Keep forgetting to press Alt. Uh, let's have a little look at this bit. So what's this bit? This looks like the front part of the ship. As you can see. So it looks like he's smuggling paint. And it's gone, bleh, it's gone everywhere. Okay. That's just loads of, loads of standard metal and stuff. There's nothing really exciting here. Wait a minute, what's this? There's a fridge here. The safest private property Ooh, and the global funeral it's a retina. Agency is ah. To the it's the breath edge okay. funeral agency. We care about your reputation. Why, why is the chicken just open? Nah, lead paint. That's what we wanted. And some tape. Apparently that's the pirate's most professional. Well, that's his most uh, wanted items. Right. Now, where's my balloon gone? I forgot. I completely forgot where my balloon was then. Luckily, you didn't notice that. In fact, I can edit, edit that out. Right, we're going to get our oxygen back. Get this to full. Let's have another little explore around here. So, we're finding all of the metals. The shuttle's reconstructed for pumping paint from the liner tanks. Such paint sells for a lot of money on the black market, although smugglers are happy about their profit only for a short time due to the paint's toxicity. So does that mean that they've stolen the paint from somewhere then? Does that mean I can find the paint elsewhere? Um, I'm not seeing anything. I'm just worried I'm going to miss something by not seeing like one little bit. Hang on, what's this, uh... Is that? No, it's just a bit of... I thought it was a bit of, a uh, Pipe or something we could use. There's a whole bit underneath, though. Let's, um... Let's go and get our oxygen back and, uh, fly down to that little bit. Okay. So I've used a quarter of me oxygen already. <coughs> so we're gonna fly down to this bottom bit. And see what's down here. Might as well use our uh, zippy thing. So what's this then? It's like a massive big... Is there anything underneath it? Nope. There's a big fat load of nope. And... From playing around with the, um, the, sp the speed that my suit can travel... I think I can travel about 350 meters, so I'm gonna have to make the decision to go and ooh, wait a minute, what's this bit? I have to make the decision if I want to go and uh, investigate that thing to the side. It's more paint. I thought it was like an escape pod or something. No, no space room for me. Right. I think we're pretty much covered everything here then. Right. I guess we need to go to back to well towards this thing down here. I don't know what it is. 
Okay, we're on full jetpack, so let's go. Let's burn. So this is where that signal is, 470 meters away. It might be a bit close to my range. So it looks like there's a load of paint in here. Okay, I'm trying to keep turbo in. What is this? Is this like an airlock? A large accumulation of toxic colorant has been discovered. If you find a container okay. with this substance, you may receive irreversible brain damage and also improve the anti-radiation protection of the spacesuit. Well, that's what I want. I want the lead paints. I want the lead paints and glass. Okay, this is interesting. Right, oxygen is getting a bit low now. I don't want to use... I want to... Let's use one of my emergency things up first. Okay. It looks like a tank with paint. A tank of paint. Okay, we can extract it. Drill required. Okay, so we've got some paint from that. Okay... This is like, this looks like a massive like freight yard or something. So is this where the uh, the pirates come from? Right, I think we should really put our uh, oxygen thing down. Where are we gonna put it though? Um, right, quick, let's, let's just get it put down. Oh, ooh, that was close. Right, so we've got our oxygen, so we can explore in here now. Okay, what secrets are you going to reveal to me? So, looks like a major big docking thing this. Is that a docking ring or something? Okay, let's go inside the ship. What is in the belly of the beast? So these are like new things. What are these? Break, lead plate. Oh yeah, I think we need lead plate, don't we? Well, it was, it was lead paint, but... I've got lead, um, I've just picked up a load of paint, didn't I? So surely, let's see, well, it's always worth breaking these open. Oh, what? I nearly broke my thing then. I've only got one left. Ooh, oxygen. Um, right, let's get my oxygen topped up. I think that's metal over there. Okay, charge up again. Oh, I forgot to charge. I really should have brought some food and water with me. I might have to think about heading back soon. All right, let's let's try and uh, speed this up a little bit. Okay, that look, to me looks like uh, pretty much a dead end down here. I've got some random floating lead. I might as well take that. It saves me having to bash it. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that did not look like the lead paint I needed. They should paint now. Boo. Right, I'm not gonna. I'm a bit. I've only got one scrapper, so I'm not gonna bash every single thing I see. But there's plenty of this uh, lead. Free floating lead. I should get all this. And what's that? Is that a cryopod? What is it? Hmm, just a bit of fuselage. Okay, I need to get my oxygen back again. Okay, we'll have one last... Actually, we've got, a, we've got enough for a few refills. Let's quickly come here. I want to explore more of this ship. Because there's like those two big containers there. Now, are they the same paint containers? Like the round ones. I can see some lighting in there as well. Ooh, another paint thing there. See, why are these flashing? Go inside that one. I don't think they do anything. They look exciting, but I don't think they do anything. Okay, so there is some electricity in here still. We can cut that and get a load of cloth if we wanted, I think. I don't really need that at the moment. Do you know what? I think I've got a feeling that that is pretty much it. 
I mean, we can get some random bits of paint. But I'm getting loads of lead. I hope I need this much lead. Maybe you don't need to actually drill it out. You can just uh, run around and collect it. Okay, we're going to fill up the oxygen and we're going to head back then. Let's uh, not waste our turbo thing, so we're going to uh, fill this up now. And we're going to try and get out of here. My food and drink is really low. Okay. Back to the ship we need to go. Okay, hopefully we can just go the way we came. 400 meters till our next uh, destination. That seems really far away. Now, I don't know if there's any benefit in waiting for your turbo thing to run out completely, then using it again, or if you should just use it. Doesn't seem to be an advantage either way, really. Right, this, this, is, this might be quite close, actually. Because I think we used an oxygen candle in order to get further into that mass, so... I'm going to wait for this to fill right up, and then we're going to burn. Right, we're on 30, and I'm just going to use it now. Right, now it's 20. Ooh. 150. We might take... We could take a little bit of damage, or we could use the uh, oxygen candle. I think we've still got one left. Yeah, let's, let's just take a little bit of damage. We're, we're near up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. See, you can take some damage. Don't worry about taking little bits of damage. As long as you don't stay too long outside without the drink, because that is what, what will kill you. Speaking of drink, I need to get some. But I've always got room for a bit of metal in my life, so we're going to grab them. Right, we're going back to the ship now. I'm going to try and grab some ice as we're going. Okay. I've not got any water with me at all. No. It's in trouble. You can't craft without the actual water. Ooh, this might, this might be closer than the oxygen. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, we need to get in here, and we need to make water ASAP. Right, here we go. Coming in hot. Okay, let's make some water. Oh, that was close. That was far too close. Right, we need to go and get some more uh, ice. And yeah, make some more water. Wow, that was that was a bit too close. So we'll collect some ice. Ooh. And we'll get some uh, green stuff as well. Make some uh, space nom noms. How come it, I, well, I struggle to find resources and then I just see it from a distance and I'm like, yeah, there's metal, there's some space snot. There's some more space snot. Okay. Let's get inside. Let's uh, stack up. Right. So, now the thing with those oxygen things we made, you you can bash them with the handy scrapper if you want to get them back, but you only really get, like, a, I think it's a couple of pieces of ice or something back, so it's not really that much worth it. Okay, I'm just going to uh, drink this. Here we go. Right, now, have we got any new recipes now? So, resources. We can make lead paint. Excellent. And we've already got one piece. So we'll make another piece. I've got far too much lead. I needed three pieces of lead. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Right, so... We've got, we've got something to make then, haven't we? The radiation thing, so... If we get four uh, aluminium and a roll of fabric, we can do that. Right, I have got lots of space junk in here. 
Now, fabric, fabric, fabric. Right. We need to make a roll of fabric. And we also needed this. Now, I, I think I need more aluminium. So we might have to go and have a little search for that. Um, we can make a roll of fabric, though. Mm-hmm. Um, so now we need to get one more piece of metal. And we also need glass as well to make the helmet. So let us see if we can uh, find some aluminum. Now, they have said in the, um, the guidebook that you can find it um, from like crashed ships and stuff. But I've mainly found it just on the, rock, the rocks over here. In fact, hope, hopefully that's it. No, that's ice. So it looks so similar to that, but it's not that one. This might be it. We might be in business, boys and girls. Yes. Okay. Um, I don't know how much I need, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna extract it because it is, it is pretty rare. You can also, if you're so inclined, let me see if I can find it. Where is it? Let's go back towards the ship. Around here. If you look for the thing that looks like candy. There we go. Oh no, we need the grabber. What? We have, we have got a grabber. There we go. Grab that. Ooh. Quick. Get inside. Do not want to die. There we go. Right. <laughs> right, so if we use this now, we have got a thing. We can make um, batteries now. Which are... Which are... Um, there you go. Metal and alkali mix a battery. Or you can just bash up radios, whichever you prefer. Right, we've got the enhanced suit now. So this gives us plus 50 radiation protection. So let's craft one of those suckers. Nice! Do not use while pregnant, apparently. Ah, oh, we'll have to take our chances. Okay, so we're look, looking pretty uh, stacked out now. We only need the helmet, and I want to go and explore to the um, the blue the blue zone. I'm going to call it. I know it's really cold there, but these oxygen things are the bomb. So we are going to try and make some more of these. Right, we can make one. Excellent. Can make another two. Ooh, I could do with an. I wonder if I could do with another one for later on or not. We have got an alkali there as well. Um, I think we we'll probably need to make another grabber. Well, the scrapper. We'll make that. In fact, let's make a couple of those. They seem to be super, super useful. Uh, should we get to Crazy Town and do three? No, that'll do. Right, let's make a little bit of space up. So, refined metal, no, we don't need to carry that. Paint, we don't need to carry that. All of the metals, we don't need to carry that. Or the paint. Uh, however, we could do with a little bit more food. So let's make another thing with food. Okay, we're going to eat that. Now, have we got any oxygen candles left? Yes, we have. We'll take two of them with us. Uh, we don't need the scissors. I'll take the eyeball. I don't know if we need it or not. Mm, is that going to be enough food to last us, though? Not really got a huge amount of food. Right, let's get, let's get our health back as well. So we're going to rest a little while. Let's make sure we've got full, uh, full health. Nice. Right, I'm going to... I'm going to commit a bit of a scavenging quest now. We're going to uh, run out here. I'm going to get some food. I want to I want to get fully stocked up with food and water before we go. So I think that's going to be a good point for me to end this now. So uh, yeah, so this is Breath Edge. And next episode, we are, we're off into the blue zone. See what's over there. Anyway, that's it for now. I'm Shirley Rocks. Thank you for watching. See you next time.